Hello everybody, Multiman37 back here with another review, this time of the Deluxe Sose Q Sonic Arrow and Lemon Energy Lock Seed from Kamen Rider Gaim. Um, this is the, um, the main weapon that the Genesis Riders all use and the Lock Seed for, uh, Kamen Rider Duke. So, let's take a look at the, our items here. Um, starting with the box, lock seed, and then the arrow. So, so on the front we have, uh, Zangetsu Melon Arms, or, yeah, Melon Energy Arms, Zangetsu Shin Melon Energy Arms, uh, Carbon Rider Duke, uh, Lemon Energy Arms, uh, the arrow on the center, and, uh, And, uh, you know, there's the top part, um, the little banner thing. I don't know what that thing's called. Uh, on this side, we have Kamen Rider Zangetsu Shin, uh, holding the arrow. And a little bit the same thing on side, except he's gonna slash you, because that makes sense to slash people with arrows. You did not see that. You did not see that. <sighs> anyway top we have basically the same picture like on the Genesis driver except lemon energy has been replaced with melon energy and then we have peach and cherry there and then on the bottom we have uh, Kamen Rider Duke lemon energy arms Kamen Rider Zangetsu Shin melon energy arms and then on the back we have all the things that you're gonna do with this mother trucker. So. So yeah, let's take a look at the lock seed. Here we have the lemon energy lock seed. Um, comparison, you know, here's the melon energy lock seed. They're around, since they're the same thing, you know, here they are. The only really real difference uh, to the energy lock seeds, uh, besides you know from the original like counterparts, uh, is that you know they're just completely different. But it, from each other, I don't know what I was saying. Uh, from each other, they just have different you know kind of same thing. Different fronts and different buttons, kind of like kind of like the kind of like the others. Um, but it, um, Lemon Energy is my favorite, and Kamen Rider Duke is my favorite. I wish I could actually get, like, a costume, like, an actual cosplay costume, so I can cosplay as, uh, Duke, because he's one of my favorite writers. And I guess Gaim, because he's the main writer, so... I have to, anyway, um, of course. So, yeah, let's turn this thing on. The button on over here is yellow to match the one inside, ELS1, and then when we pop it open, that's the melon open up. I wish that these didn't come off, because I, I didn't, I don't think I mentioned this in my review of the Genesis driver, but when you open these, it's very easy to pop them all off. They do come back on very easily, but I don't like that. That means they're pr prone to breaking and cracking. I might actually just glue it so it does not go anywhere. Um, but I guess that's for safety reasons, so in case you drop it, that was a loud sound in the background. So in case you drop it and the parts go flying, it doesn't break at the hinge. So, I guess I'll just leave it like that. I guess I just better be careful. So pop this lock open. They now unlike the uh, regular lock seeds that have different mecha uh, mechanisms of opening, these all have the push in system similar to Suica, which I actually do have Suica. It's sitting in my uh, thing right there. You can tell that these are the same, and they're vi it's very easy to hit the button, and I don't like that. So let's open this up. You get a little tune, which, at the end, which is awesome, and I don't think you saw the light. So 
So let's put this in the... Let's attach it, set, set doll, and then lock on. This time it says, so lemon energy arms, and this time it actually did have a phrase instead of the musical tune. It said, fight the power or fight back. I'm kind of thinking it said fight back. Um, but if you translate, if it, I've watched the ones like from Rider Fan or something like that. The subtitles there say fight power. Just fight power. And then I do, and of course it does activate the yellow light in the chamber. So let's do the two attacks versus Skosh. I'm gonna pull it back. This legitimately sounds like a drill. Like that one just sounds like a drill. Like normally I just pretend that would be a drill kick. It would be awesome if Duke can do a drill kick, but no, nah, he had to escape on her uh, somewhere else. I do know that Baron uses a Genesis Driver too, and uh, this arms twice for sparking. I don't think I got it that time. Soda power. Yeah, so I said soda power in case you couldn't hear me. So, yeah, I'm going to leave this in the driver for now. Actually, um, this can also be... Uh, actually, no, I'm going to save that for the last. Because I want to save the gym arms and the... Yeah, I didn't hear the click, so, wow. Anyway, yeah, you need to hear it actually make the, make the, just the, before it can actually reset the sounds. So, yeah, here is the Sosei Hughes Sonic Arrow. I'm just going to call it the Sonic Arrow, though. Very nice, same design as the Genesis Driver, except now it has these translucent blue parts. You know, the matte black is very nice on here, same on the trigger, on, on the handle. The trigger's right here for the sword, which, yeah. They, for close combat, they can use their bows as sword, which is kind of silly, but at the same time, kind of awesome. This is the button to release the lock seed, which is, again, very inconveniently placed. I wish that was somewhere else, since, like on the back of the handle. I think I said that in my Musou Say review. Kind of like the Gabba Revolver. I wish it could have been something like the Gabba Revolver, where you could uh, push the handle, and then the lock seed would come out, because you're holding it, because you don't, because it's weird to, like, grab it somewhere else. Especially on the Muso Saber. That one felt we really weird. I almost sounded like Elmer Fudd. Yeah, that's what I need. So let's turn this on. The lights are right here. I can find the switch. It actually says its full name. This is the only toy. Actually, there are two toys that say their full name. Uh, the Sonic Arrow and the DJ Gun. Um... So they say their full names. That was Soseki Sonic Arrow. And uh, yeah, mine's a little chipped away at places like... I know there's a part here that's chipped away at. I forget where it is. Either that or I was hallucinating. But definitely this part has been chipped away. So yeah. A little bit of damage. I think this was used because I got this on eBay because CS Toys had a lack of them. So for those little blade attacks, you push this button. Those two slashing sounds. And saying this ahead, it doesn't activate any special sounds when you have a lock seed because the button over here doesn't move. So, but it does when you pull the, the thing. By the way. And then if you actually get it in the red zone, because there was a red light. You get an exploding attack, which is awesome. 
And, uh, yeah, you can rapid fire. And these actually, I like how these move along. Like, I like how this part moves, and then all these move, and these are all bendy and stuff. So, yeah. I'm gonna take off the locked seed for lemon energy and stick it in here. The reason I didn't show these in the Muso Saber is because they don't match up with the Muso Saber depending on how you do it. Because uh, if you're holding the button too long, it's not just going to go off. Um, because it's made to wait for when you're doing this. A little we'll standby sound and then pull it for the awesomest sound ever. Yeah, it actually waits until you pull the arrow, which is something that the regular lock seeds can't do. And of course, the regular attacks. It doesn't do a red light, and yeah, that's a lot of little charging power to go through for that one little arrow. But oh well. And it, and they each give a little musical tune. I'm also going to do it for Melon Energy, so let's lock off this one. And use. That thing is off. And use. Pretty cool. I do like the little dun dun da da da. Zangetsu Shin does kind of is kind of awesome, but it's not really one of my favorites. Kind of second second favorite. Or rather, third, because Gaim's in second. And, and just in case, nothing comes out of here. So, yeah, if you put a regular lock seed, though, in here, so I'm going to get one. I'm not going to bother getting melon, because that one's in my bedroom, and I don't want to go all the way back to my bedroom, because I'm at my, like, countertop over here. Let's just use orange. Doesn't really match up. You actually have to like quickly do it. Otherwise, it doesn't match up. And of course the power. So yeah, you gotta do it really quickly. And even though it, the first time in the show, Gaim tried to use it in the, his Sengoku driver directly, it didn't work. You still can use it in here. Because it does open here. I'm not gonna bother with the attacks. Um, actually, yeah, you get this. Why not? Still sounds like a drill. And sparking. Reason it didn't open the moment I hit this is because the button to open it is so small and the reason Melon Energy did it really quick is because the button's really out, out there. Sorry about that random jump cut. My phone decides to cut me off due to lack of memory. Um, so let's just get straight to the Jimba Arms, which lemon the Jimba Lemon Arms is one of my favorites. It was one of Gaim's first of the Jimba Arms. Again, I'm not I'm not sure if he'll ever use a uh, Jimba Melon. I wish he would. But either way, what the show can't do, the toy can probably do. So, whatever. And attach the Genesis Core. Set and readying. And we can't forget. Did you know? 
lock them both on. These are really back heavy, or front heavy. And mix it. So this is the first Jimba Arms Jimba Lemon. Ha ha! And now we now there is Ode in here to match up with this Loxy. So let's do the attacks first. Scotch. That really sounds like a drill. Two. Ore. And then three is barking. And that is all that this thing can do. Now this is an awesome little weapon to have. The first ever arrow toy in in uh, in uh, Kamen Rider history, which is actually pretty freaking awesome. And it does what it and it's a nice size. Could be a little bit bigger, maybe just by that much on these two parts right here. But either way, it's still pretty nice. It, it's still pretty nice, and I think you should pick this thing up. Until then, I will see you guys later. Take care.